solve x square into y minus z into p plus y square into z minus x into q equals to z square into x minus y. So to answer this, this equation is of the form capital P small p plus capital Q small q is equals to r. This is Lagrange's equation. Lagrange's equation. So here if we compare this equation with this one so in place of capital P we have x square into y minus z capital Q is equals to y square into z minus x capital R equals to z square into x minus y. So we can write subsidiary equation subsidiary equation subsidiary equation is dx by capital P dy by capital Q dz by capital R this is equals to dx by x square into y minus z dy by y square into z minus x equals to dz by z square into x minus y so now we will choose now choosing p dash equals to 1 by x q dash equals to 1 by y and r dash equals to 1 by z we choose p dash q dash r dash in such a way that p p dash plus q q dash plus r r dash becomes 0 we can testify also p is x square into y minus z into p dash is 1 by x plus q is y square into z minus x q dash is 1 by y plus r is z square into x minus y r dash is 1 by z this is equals to this is equals to xy minus xz plus yz minus xy plus zx minus zy so this one this one got cancelled this one this one got cancelled and this one this one got cancelled so this is equals to 0 so we always choose p dash q dash r dash such that p p dash plus q q dash plus r r dash becomes 0 so if this value is 0 then p dash dx plus q dash dy plus r dash dz this will also become 0 so this implies p dash is 1 by x dx then q dash is 1 by y dy r dash is 1 by z dz this one also 0 so this implies if we integrate both the side so integrating both the sides both the sides we have we have dx by x plus dy by y plus dz by z integration equals to 0 integration so this implies this dx by x the integration is ln x plus dy by y the integration is ln y plus dz by z the integration is ln z equals to integration of 0 is 0 plus some constant so let's say we have constant c1 here also there is a constant but this constant this constant goes to here and this becomes some c1 so this implies ln of ln a plus ln b plus ln b formula that is ln of x y z equals to some c1 if we take this ln to this side so it becomes e to the power c1 so this is some other constant c1 so this is our first equation next 
choosing p double dash is equals to 1 by x square q double dash equals to 1 by y square r double dash equals to 1 by z square we choose p double dash q double dash r double dash in such a way that this result equals to 0 so we can check this one this is x square into y minus z into 1 by x square y square into z minus x into 1 by y square plus z square into z x minus y into 1 by z square so we have y minus z plus z minus x plus x minus y this becomes 0 so if this result becomes 0 then this result also becomes 0 so p double dash dx plus q double dash dy plus r double dash dz equals to 0 so in place of p double dash q double dash r double dash we put 1 by x square 1 by y square 1 by z square then integrating both the sides we have we have dx by 1 by dx into 1 by x square the integration is x minus x to the power minus 1 y minus 1 plus y to the power minus 1 by minus 1 plus z to the power minus 1 by minus 1 equals to integration of 0 is con, uh, 0 again plus some constant that is some c2 so this implies we if we take out this minus 1 we have 1 by x plus 1 by y plus 1 by z equals to some other constant c2 so this is equation 2 so from equation 1 equation 1 and 2 we have the solution and the solution is solution is phi of c1 comma c2 equals to 0 that is some function of x y z comma 1 by x plus 1 by y plus 1 by z equals to 0 so the answer is some function of x y z comma 1 by x x plus 1 by y plus 1 by z equals to 0 we also we can also write it like this f of some function of x y z equals to 1 by x plus 1 by y plus 1 by z we can also write it like this also